Hey guys, Luke here, and welcome to tutorial number one of my tutorial series. So in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to import a world using Mineways into Cinema 4D. So what you'll need is Mineways. Mineways is the software that everybody uses for whatever software you want. It works for Blender, Maya, and also Cinema 4D, of course. So what Mineways does is that it gets your world and makes it into a file that Cinema 4D can actually open. So to get Mineways, you just pretty much need to go to Mineways. And right here, I'll also leave a link in the description if you want it. So right here at the top you have Download Mineways for Windows or Download Mineways for Mac. I personally use Windows, so I'm gonna use Windows, of course. So now that it's downloaded, you can pretty much just move this folder onto here. And then you have Mineways. So when you open Mineways, you pretty much have this. There's no world here. So here, paths kinda change. Or you use a world that you've already created into Minecraft itself, or you use a world you downloaded. If you want to use a world that you actually already built in Minecraft, you want to go to File, Open World, and select the map that you want to use. If you want to use a world that you downloaded, you click Open, you select the world that you want, and you click the level dot dot. So when you open the world, you see the entire world from the top. So now what you have to do, you have to select the place that you want into Cinema 4D. You can move around by dragging and holding the left button. So you select the place by holding the right mouse button and dragging it like this. You can click yes, but you don't really have to. So these buttons are for the height. So if I drag this down all the way, you can see it actually starts removing layers. And right here you can keep the bedrock or just remove the entire floor, that's completely up to you. Once you have the selected place, you go to file. Export for rendering and you save it to the place where you want it to work. You can give it a little name Right, so here you want to make sure that make each block is on 1000 millimeters because one block Equals one meter you press ok and it will pretty much make it for you So once you've exported the world that you want you go into cinema 4d you press file Open go to the folder you want to use and click the obg file make sure that the scale is on one meter and press OK. So when you import a world you see that everything is completely white. Which is of course not what you want. So you click on the first texture right here. You scroll down and hold shift left click to select all of the textures. You go to basic right here. And make sure you uncheck reflectance. And check alpha. Then go to color. And then with texture you go to the three dots. Then you need to select the texture. RGBA. The only problem with this at the moment is that when you render it out, everything is blurry at the moment. The way to fix this is you go right here on sampling, and you press none. Now you want to go to alpha, go on the three dots again, and use the alpha texture. Make sure you once again go to sampling and press this on none. So as you can see, we now have the basic world with the textures on it. In the next tutorial, I'll show you how to do lighting, a background, a nice sky, and all that stuff. Make sure to subscribe so that you see all the other tutorials. And make sure you check the playlist so that you know what to do next. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye!